the money monster will be running late in a race loaded with early speed. He also gets the nod using Corey Lanery picking up the bracket for Eddie Kennelly. Royal Asset requires a big class fall for Wes Ward and will be challenging to beat at this level. Pray hard is a good danger with Gary Stevens back in town. Get informed before you make your selections in the gaming window derby day. Danielle Lerner slash Courier Journal slash Watch It. Morning line odds maker Mike Batalia presents free picks and tips for Wednesday's horse races at Keeneland. Initial post is at 1.05 p.m. Make America Great probably needed his last race after a four-month layoff. Charlie Lowe Presti has his horses ready for this meet and this one looks best with Jose Ortiz picking up the mount. LA Machina Gris has the tactical speed to be in contention throughout and is the one to beat. My eminence is a definite contender. Wonderstone debuts for Ward, who, as usual, is dominating the baby races here at Keeneland, winning the last four in a row. This one didn't have the fastest works at Turfway but had a nice gate work here last Friday and should be ready. Valmy now also had a good work here last week for Joe Sharp and Adam Bestz, who had a couple of winners here last week. Strike play is also trained by Ward and will be tough if he draws in. Read more, here are the horses that are in, and out, of the 2018 Kentucky Derby. Divine Desire has been off since December but posted a recent bullet work and Larry Jones has won with three of his six runners this meet. Speedmaster slipped heels and lost his best chance last out. He shouldn't mind the move back to dirt and figures to run well again in here. Stapleton is a solid threat. Santa Monica was a Group 3 winner in Ireland and is a proven winner at a day's distance of a mile and a half. She makes her U.S. debut for Chad Brown who is having a terrific meet and she looks like a solid bet to win this one with Ortiz aboard. Peru was a beaten favorite last out at Gulfstream but Mike Maker has a very good record with horses stretching out to marathon distances for the first time. She could run much better today. Can he fits with these? Buddy ANN was fourth in her debut at Gulfstream and the runner-up in that one came back to win here on Saturday by six lengths. Ian Wilkes adds Lasix and she can win this one with Julian Leperu back aboard. Slim Fit hasn't raced since July but has been training steadily for Tom Proctor. She looks dangerous in this spot. Pocketbook will be tough to beat if she handles the move to the dirt. Parole figures to be rallying from off of the pace and her best race would be good enough to win this one. Inspired Vow just missed against the top pick back in February and came back to win next out. She has the speed to be dangerous. Soul Singer can run well at decent odds. Ursula Andres drops a notch in class and owns a win over this track. She rates the edge for Bernie Flint with Lanery picking up the mound. Dancing Waves drops back into a claiming race and figures to run well with Florangero aboard. Or a bird fits with these. Mm -hmm.